Arch Fail is a twin stick bullet hell. Similar to Enter the Gungeon or uh, Binding of Isaac or, oh God, so many games. So, 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 so many games. Um, but what makes this one different is that it's new and it's different. Now, uh, what makes this game different is uh, it, they actually really hark on the uh, on the RPG elements. It's not a it's not a roguelike. Uh, you would expect to see a game like this, and on the surface, you're like, oh yeah, it's another you know pixel art art roguelike, whatever. Um, and that's not the case at all. And in this case, it is a uh, it really is an open world exploratory RPG with just tons of rooms that you just walk into and you just get you know, just wrecked and you just had to like fight your way out of. Um, similar to, you know, like a tile based game, like, you know, Legend of Zelda or something like that, or, or Binding of Isaac. Um, those things are kind of interchangeable at this point when we're talking about certain mechanics, right? Um, so I have two saves here. One is a normal save and one is an easy save. I did the easy save on stream because I felt like I was getting my ass kicked in normal. I don't know if this is normal or hard, honestly. Um, but what I noticed though, after putting, I, I'm actually further on this account than I am on this account, right? On the easy one because of just because of the amount of time it takes to get through stuff, but also, um, um, the few, the, the, I had fewer deaths, obviously, going through uh, uh, easy mode, and, and it's because the uh, the only difference between the two that I've seen um, is the amount of damage that bullets do to you. But then I decided to kind of tackle this again because I was like, okay, maybe I'm doing something wrong here. I'm playing the game wrong. And it turns out I kind of am, right? I kept on throwing myself at this area. If we go over here, I kept on uh, throwing myself into this pit over here on stream yesterday, and I was getting my ass kicked. Um, when the game is really designed to give you kind of a freedom of choice, right? Like you're supposed to be able to explore and go and check things out, uh, go get more powerful on one side and then come back, you know, on the other and, and, and do work, right? And so that's kind of what I've been trying to do uh, is going exploring. I started over here. Here, yeah, I came back and teleported over here, and then I just kind of come this way. I went up here, got my ass kicked by a boss. I was like, you know what, fuck, I'm just going over here. <laughs> and just keep on exploring. And you know what? That's that's how you're supposed to play the game. The goal is to go and collect all of these shards, right? Uh, which it seems easy, it seems like they're within reach, but there's a lot of tiles between here and there, and the difficulty does scale up pretty quickly. Um, you know, it's a bullet hell. So your mileage may vary. Not everybody's good at these kinds of games. I feel like I'm okay. Uh, at these, um, I do enjoy them a lot, though. I enjoy them a lot more than I, I enjoy them more than I am. Uh, uh, my enjoyment exceeds my skill. How's that? Um, so first, just to give you a taste of the of the uh, of the bullet hellness of this, we're gonna go into one of these challenge rooms. I have not done this yet, so I have no idea what's gonna happen when we get in here. But uh, typically, these are you start in a little circle, and then you have. Um, a, a, a start trigger, which is that little pad right there in the middle. So when I trigger that, it's going to spawn these guys. going to go around in circles. Just like kind of turrets that go around circles. And they're just going to shoot towards the middle. Now, sometimes they, sh they shoot different types of projectiles. So you have to like watch the first couple to kind of learn the patterns. Uh, and then, you know, you got multiple stages to go through. Now, in easy mode, it'll make you re... There's like three stages you have to go through. In easy mode, you restart the stage. Uh, in normal mode, you have to go all the way back to the beginning. Uh, like, like right now, where I first entered in. And you have to redo all the stages again. So that's another difference between easy mode and, I believe, normal or hard mode or whatever this is. There's no way to tell, actually. So, I want to start. So here we go. Okay, so it's going to be one of those. You have to collect these gems. Whoa! Oh, God. Okay, yeah, well, these, these, these spin. These are tricky. Gotta watch to the to the right of your character. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, it's, actually, no, they're, they're going different directions each time. Oh, man. Okay, that's the first stage. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're gonna get two of these things. Stand in the middle to collect the first one, easy. Oh, no, we're not getting two, okay. Now we're just getting one that shoots a lot faster. This isn't so bad, but still, we can make a mistake here. Am I careful, especially when you get close to these guys? Because the bullets are really confined. Gotta get away from him. Oh, nice. Oh, man, what luck. What luck, they line right up. Oh, except for that one. Now, if I take one hit, it restarts the entire thing. So we have to be <laughs> we have to be mindful of uh, of not taking a hit anywhere. And I could dash through some of these, but the dash is really short. Like it, could, it would be really nice if the dash was a little longer. It almost feels like it's not enough of a dash uh, because of how short the dash is. Okay, I'm gonna be quiet now. Whoa! <laughs> Gotta get away from this guy. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Such a dumb mistake. All right, so that's that's the challenge room. <laughs> I'll come back another time and do it. I'm so close, damn it. 
Anyways, so back to the actual open world element here. These fountains right here will refill your potions uh, and your health and all that stuff. But um, it will not... Uh, but oh, sorry, And it will reset all the rooms around you. So what I'm going to do is, because this this is so close to a... Let me see. Uh, oh, no, there's one right here. Uh, we're going to teleport to this town uh, first. And I'm going to go and drop some money off because I'm tired of losing money. So drop some money off. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yep, good. We'll go back. No, not anymore. Uh, and then we're going to go jump back in this. We're going to come back to where we were. And we're going to keep on exploring because there's more to explore. And there's uh, another town over here. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh God. I walked right in. Sorry, Sunny distracted me. Uh, she's picking at something over here. I don't know what. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So much worse in the room. Uh, so there's this guy coming out of the ground. Okay. 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 Wow. Took a couple hits there. Okay, 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 okay. Do I have the right weapon for this? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, do spiders have armor? Or, sorry, scorpions? They do, right? Oh, my God. This is crazy. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at that. I lost two gold. That's why I went and deposited that money. See? 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 Now, I'm going to go ahead and grab this guy and go back again. We're going to try that room one more time before we decide to abandon and go somewhere else. <laughs> Here we go. We'll tag that. Throw that. Just be mad. Let me see. So Jackal Spear. Let's take a look at our, our inventory here. I know I, I probably should go to a town and probably... Um, let's, do, let's give it another shot and we'll see what happens. Uh, oh, hold on a second. Uh, defense 10. What is this? Defense uh, 4. Oh, but magic damage. Yeah, I do use a lot of magic. So, um, Although, is magic really useful right here? I don't know. Armor Pen 2 inflicts... Uh, okay, so hmm. Maybe we do put this on here. And we'll use this weapon here. Because it does do it does do pretty good work, so we just gotta get close enough to hit them. So there are melee, there's magic weapons, there's bow and arrows, there's thrown, there's 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 a number of different weapon classifications. Um, actually, I believe thrown is actually in the same category as range, so I don't want to like com uh, uh, conflate those two. Uh, oh gosh! And then last one. There, good. Now we just take care of this guy, big boy. Come up. Uh, there we go. As we clear the room. Big splash. Jingle sounds. We go through. We collect all the resources there. Obsidian shards. We can use that for crafting, which we should go back and do, but we're not going to because we're being very stubborn. Let's take a look at the map here and see. Down here to the uh, up here to the right, there's a town. Over here, there's a shard. Um, but over here, there might be something. So let's go and explore over here and see. Let's go and see. And if you know, if it's uh, if it's nothing, or if we get our ass kicked, then we'll just go another direction next time. <laughs> oh gosh, the, the shell's chasing me. Perfect. The shell could take maximum damage from an armor-piercing weapon. Look at that. Oh, smashing that. Oh, jeez. You want to grab this loot over here? Sure. Since we're up in this corner. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Throw that at him. There are some environmentals you can interact with in order to throw, etc. Okay, let's get through this guy fast. Good. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Keep our cool. Keep that guy out of my range here. Whoa. Let's go and heal up. We only got three of these until we get to another, uh... Alright, this guy's being silly. Oh, gosh. Let's go smash some loot here. Get closer. There we go. Oh, oh, damn, that guy's barely dodged. That guy sure did. Oh. I also have bombs, too, but they're not as useful as taking an item and throwing it or just, like, hitting them because you place it and the guys run out of the range. Run out of range. And also doesn't do a lot of damage. I think there's an upgrade that I'm due. I'm due for. So what's in here? Ooh, nothing. Oh, cool. I'm really glad it came over here. I'll take that, take that bomb real quick. Yeah, see, not really a oh, lot of damage. Oh, gosh. Oh, boy. Don't get stuck in a corner. Need that freedom of movement. Oh, my gosh. Oh, fuck. Rock. Oh, God. Okay. Whoa. Hit this, hit this thing. Okay. We cannot leave the room. We're kind of stuck here. Until we solve this problem. Uh... <laughs> oh, God. Hit with some poison. Is that going to kill me? No, it's not. Okay. Let that, let that, uh, that uh, uh, sandworm come over here. Oh, God. He lobs over the top. Oh, 46 gold is gone. It's fine, you know, we're gonna go somewhere else. Fuck that, fuck that guy. Let me see, we'll go over here. Then we'll go down to the right. We're gonna try to make our way to that town. Okay, I'm just gonna run to that wall a few times. Yeah, get these guys out of here. Get these guys, get these guys out of here. Get out of here with your, with your shells. <laughs> Give me that loot. 
Give them shells I could use to make a shell weapon or something. I'm sure. I'm sure. Every other item is... Well, actually, pretty much every every item you pick up gets put towards some kind of weapon or some kind of armor that you could craft. Which is a cool thing, right? You get, like, scorpion, like a poison sack. It's like, cool, I might have some kind of, like, dot. Like, kind of dotted weapon or something like that. Dot inducing, dot casting, dot, uh, 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 inflicting. That's what I'm looking for. Oh, huh, oh, good. Throw those over there. The coins don't disappear, by the way, so if you're out here fucking around, there's coins over there, you're killing dudes, don't worry about it. I, I've hung out for a while, and they've not disappeared, so. Those things move, though, careful. Is there anything over here for me? No, okay. Make our way to, let me see. Whoa, okay, definitely, before I hit that, uh, oh god, oh god, oh god! <laughs> <laughs> Good. Bomb just out of reach. Yep. Range sucks. Trying to trying to farm up loot <laughs> or resources while also killing. Uh this might there might be something down here. It's a question mark. Aha! Ooh. Bomb power up. There we go. Just speak of the devil. Speak of the devil. Okay, so we got upgraded bombs. Word. Uh, let me see. You know, keep uh, keep that weapon. The weapon seems to be pretty good. And then let's check out. What's gonna check out? Sorry, the map. Um, we could go either way. Let's go down, over, and then up to this town that's just kind of isolated itself. Hmm. Oh, this guy right here. Was some bitch. Was some bitch. Was some bitch. Ruined my last run. Got to test out this. Um, this. Oh, this new bomb. Hold on. Yeah, you, 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 you. Good. Poison set. Okay, new bomb, new bomb, new bomb. Just, just two of them. Ooh, that's pretty good. Pretty good. These will break those two. And you recharge your bomb by just hitting things. So the more damage you do to something, enemies or whatever, like you'll just recharge your bomb pretty quickly. So there's no real problem with using the bomb over and over again. It's just, oh, oh I switched weapons. Um, it's just the range and all that stuff that kind of sucks. But you know, maybe better now. Mm -hmm. That's not bad. Okay, yeah, well, I think I was just being harassed there. <laughs> I was being harassed. All right, let's see where else we can go. That's the beauty of the game, is we can go wherever we want. Let's go here, and let's go harass this other boss. Different, a different venue. Mm-hmm, oh, okay, wait for a recharge, there we go. Oh, nice, all these are rooms that I don't have to repeat. Beautiful. Oh, the crabs. Uh, I got hit with the, the crab breaker or whatever. Oh, that's another thing, too. I believe, I, I believe, I haven't, like, actually sat here and tested this, but I believe that um, uh, certain types of weapons, in typical RPG form, uh, certain weapons have different, uh, certain effects on certain enemies. Does that make sense? Um, so there's synergy between, you know, the different, um, uh, uh, different types of weapons. So, like the hammer, I was given the hammer by, by an NPC. It's like, oh, you're, gonna, you're about to fight some crabs, so go take one of these. Oh, cool, another bomb upgrade. I knew I was due for one. I didn't know I was going to get two. Sick. Okay, hold on a sec. What's over here? Oh, and a chest. Oh, I like it. Oh, this is like one, two, three. There's so many here. Bubble Sept. What? Oh, that's pretty rad. Let's go and switch to my um, magic helm. Give me my. There we go. Did I actually put that back in my bag? I did. Okay. Oh, I, like, I have a tome here also. Splash tome. 26, uh, 5, 4. I wish they just tell me DPS. It'd be so much easier. 97, 194, rain. Okay, sure. We'll just take that. <laughs> I don't know. Um, okay, so, 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 there's a boss over here, we can just kind of walk over there, actually, I believe this is all, yeah, you know what, we can save right here, and all the rooms will be reset, but they're all treasure rooms, so we don't have to do anything, and we get the bonus here, too, of getting plus one defense. So now let's go back, now let's go back and see about that boss, it's a crab boss, so we might be able to just hit him up real quick with the hammers, now that we're so strong, so big and strong, let me see. Let me see. I'll smash all these boys. Hey, bop, 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 bop. Hide around the corner. Let the bullets clear. No, just kidding. <laughs> They're never going to clear. <laughs> there we go. Nothing over here. Oh, some money. I want that. Here we go. Crab boss. Oh, gosh. What is it? Ghost, ghost crab. That's right. That's what his name is. Oh, Jesus, I'm taking some serious, serious ouchies here. Okay, so there's one that's real, apparently, I think. Not sure how it's worth. Drop a bomb, see what happens. Nothing. Okay, cool. Missed. 
He's gonna teleport over here, I think. Uh, is it that one? Is it this one? Is it this one? Let's drop a bomb and find out. Oh god, oh god, oh, we're so close! Damn it, man, I'm not one shit in this video. <laughs> nah, 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 man, fuck you, crab. Uh-uh. Nope, nope, here, let's try, let's try this bubble scepter we just got. I mean, that's pretty dope. Are the hammers better? I don't know. I don't know. I don't, Jesus Christ. Can I take any more, like, random damage I don't need to take? This is ridiculous! <laughs> no, shut up, bitch! Oh yeah, definitely better. Pop, 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 pop. Now I'm basically dead. Fuck it, I'm gonna go do it anyways. There we go. Let's do it. Yeah, that's right. Take that. Ta. Limited range. Limited range. Limited range. Limited range. Limited range. Get me bomb back. 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 Ouch. There it is. Teleport over here. That works. I'm out, of, I'm out of dodge, I'm out of dodge, I'm out of dodge. Out of range of my bomb again. Oh gosh. Okay, hold on a second. Take advantage. Oh god. <laughs> this take advantage. Oh god, every time. Hurry, quick. He's going to teleport over here. Oh, did I use it already? Oh, I guess I used it. Damn, I don't feel like I got any benefit from that. I got a fat coin there or something. This fat money's here. I'm about to lose if I die! No, no, no! Got him! That's right! Ghostbuster. Oh, man, we get a half a heart? Sweet, wow, what a prize. <laughs> it's all incremental upgrades, really. Dagger mastery. Ooh, daggers fire long range projectiles. Oh, okay, cool. You're probably like, what do you need that for? Well, I'll show you in just a minute. Let me go and uh, clear whatever this room is. Clear things up, get some loot, crab shells and whatnot. Okay, yep, stupid gnome. That's all that's in here. It's just, a, it's just a treasure room or just a loot room, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. It's good resources, though. Nothing there. Nothing there. Nothing there. Cool. Hey, whoa, we did it. We killed a boss. <laughs> we got some upgrades. That's really what we wanted. All these incremental upgrades add up. Okay, so now, now I'm going to show you guys. Uh, we go to the beginning, which is uh, this one here. I have 293 or 393 in the bank. Let's go ahead and drop off the rest of my money here. Nope, that's it. Now you can spend that money right out of there. You also have this this chest you could drop a bunch of shit in here. I had a bunch of other shit because I thought it was a roguelike and I was gonna have I was gonna die and come back and then loot up again. Um, but it's not. And it's not shared between any other accounts. Uh, so it's basically just here had to, just to have extra storage, I guess. I guess. Um so let's see over here. We can talk to this guy. He's gonna upgrade my potion and get mega plums. Just one. Oh, one more. Dang it. Okay, I guess not. Why do you have an exclamation mark over his head? You need supplies. Yeah, yeah, I need supplies. Let me see. Do you have anything good? Look, 200 I could spend to get an upgrade to my uh, another heart container. Pretty rad. Uh, and then over here, you can buy more badges, which is the next thing I want to show you guys. Over here in this tab, we have three out of three badge slots, right? So I could disable this one that costs two, this one is one, and I could say, okay, da da daggers fire long range projectiles. So do I have a dagger to actually practice with? No, I guess not, huh? I have a bag of knives, not quite the same. Um, yeah, I don't have any daggers, so I can't really demonstrate that. So, well, obviously we're not gonna use it. But uh, you can add little extra, little extra perks um, that help, let's see, gain extra protection heart. So you put that on, back out, and you just got one protection heart. Um, wait, is that what that is? Let me see. No, no, it doesn't count until, probably until I get into action or something. Increased chance for enemies to drop hearts when low on health. Uh, and then this is arrow bender, uh, range projectiles bend towards enemies. But it's range projectiles, not magic. Not magic. Melee, melee weapon projectiles travel further and increase magic damage. So these are the ones I have. Massively increased pickup range for magic shards. I mean, it's kind of like whatever. Gain a protection heart. Probably this one. Uh, hearts, or enemies drop hearts. 
So cool, those are the two. Uh, let me see, does that update? Uh, let me see. Why are these ones all the ones that float on the right hand side? I wonder. I wonder if it's until I. Hmm. I'm not sure. Uh, this guy over here will collect treasures. I don't have any treasures to give to him, so he says, No treasure? Get out of here. No interest. Um, and then up here in the corner is where you go to upgrade your weapons at the blacksmith or whatever this guy is. So I would go and I'd say, Okay, cool. So the. Uh, the. 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 The whisper. Wisp mother staff was pretty good for a long while. Still is pretty good. Uh, the crab hammer is pretty dope. Uh, bubble scepter, a uh, 97 damage. What is this? 85 damage? 4.08. Uh, this one is uh, 97 and one point. Oh wow! So that's pretty good. Uh, the jackal spear has been doing pretty, doing really, really well for us. So I think I'm gonna take that and then upgrade it. And it cost me 100 for the first upgrade. It's very incremental though. Look, 168 to 176. The speed does not change. The range does not change. The armor penetration does not change. So it's a very small upgrade. All the upgrades in this game is like plus one, plus two, plus one, plus two. That's it. Um, let's save a little bit of money here. We'll make that stronger. We'll save a little bit of money. Come over and see if there's anything we can buy from maybe you. I need a supplies. Yeah, it's all junk though. Yeah, it's all junk. Those are like level one shits. I'm, probably because I'm I'm at the level one area. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, increase melee damage. Increase range damage. Ooh, this is new. Badge slot. Oh, man. I could add an extra badge slot. Summon a fairy that reduces enemy defense. Oh, look at this crap. See? Yeah, those are new. How come you can't get new stuff over here, lady? Jesus Christ. Okay, over here, we got the uh, we got the blacksmith or the, the, the forge. This is where you go to craft your own weapons. It's obviously. <laughs> Someone out there is not going to know, okay? Someone out there is going to be like, well, what do you use the forge for? Uh, let's see. Whips. <laughs> excuse me. Wisp silk hood. Uh, I, I have one of those already. Uh, Wispwood helmet. This is just basically. It's think like Terraria, right? You have like tier sets and then you have one for every class or every weapon type. Same thing. Uh, let's see. Defense protection. A bandit hood. Let me see if there's... So I got a lot of things unlocked, but nothing necess... Ooh. Oh, wow. Hold on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I just spent a bunch of money on that, too. This this spear is just straight up better than than, uh, <laughs> than what I'm using. All right, fine. Uh, I see slime bubbler. Uh, poison wave tome. Ooh, sounds pretty cool. Infection snap. Now, you could swap between these pretty easily. So if you have a bunch of magic stuff you want to swap between, you can. All right. So you pretty much see most of the game. Right now, I'm gonna do. Is, well, all I'm gonna do is just get back into the fray and just see how this new build uh, holds its own against, you know, maybe whatever is, whatever is here, which probably is gonna be a, another. Um, let me see. Yeah, it's probably gonna be another zone more than anything. Let's get in. Let's see. Let us find out. We'll go and save here. Boop. Pick that up. Throw it. Let's show everyone who's boss. And now we go and crabs. Yeah, do 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 do. Whoa, no, 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 no. That guy, you gotta go. You gotta die. Good. Now, we haven't seen a lot of them, but there are some. There are some enemies that spew nothing but seeking, seeking bullets. Like oh, like these purple ones actually. Sometimes they're purple. I, maybe maybe it is the purple ones. Period. But I swear there's some, some purple ones that have been flying straight, throwing me off my game a little bit. There we go. Let me see. Let me go straight up. What is up here? Ooh. 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 Did I break any of these things? Nope. Okay. Ooh. Twisted Caverns. Oh, boy. I'm straight up in Terraria now. <laughs> oh, sorry. Stardew Valley. Stardew Valley. 100%. Look at the knockers on this angel on this freaking statue, though. Wow. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, uh, there's the second one. I can upgrade my, uh, my health pot. Next time I teleport back. Oh, another boss! It's a slime boss! Oh, great. Slime boss. What's that mean? A poison wave? No, probably not. Probably immune to poison. No, not immune to poison. But, oh gosh, he jumps around, though. Jumps around. Whoa, it's a wave! Okay. I don't have the range here for this guy. Yeah, I'm not doing anything. Uh, let's try the hammers just to see. Maybe blunt damage. Oh, shit. Just walk right through that fucking wave. Whoa! Okay, that's cool. Franken slime, huh? Nah! 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 Wait, what do we got? Let's try bubble scepter, maybe? Thank God we just go right back up into this. Thank God we just get our ass kicked over and over again. In a row. What is that? Oh, gosh. Okay, okay. I gotta be really mindful of that and stop fucking around. Okay, that's literally no damage. That's doing something. Oh, fuck me. Where am I supposed to jump? The dash is like three pixels long. <laughs> All right, let's try the poison wave. I feel like that's doing the most damage. The bubbled shit doesn't do anything. 
And I wouldn't think the poison would work because, simply because it's green. I'm, um, you know, it's green. My weapon's green. I feel like that's in, in, in RPGs. That means that they're they cancel each other out or something. Could be wrong, but it looks like it's doing so. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Uh, 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 where's the wave? Where's the wave? Where's the wave? Oh, trust, there it is. This is gonna take forever. There's gotta be another. Oh shit. Oh god. I'm kind of about to go to 100 to zero pretty fast. <laughs> Big jump. Okay, good. Nice. Okay, I gotta hit him with the hammer in order to see if it does any damage. 180, 180. Okay, this is pretty good. Range, keep some range, keep some range, wait for the wave. Okay, the wave here would suck. Okay, good, stay out of range. Okay, another one. Okay, another one. <laughs> He's not even 75%. I'm getting uh I'm getting a little hip hypnotized here. Okay, you're gonna jump, are you gonna jump? Okay, good, perfect. I have a feeling I'm not supposed to be in this fight yet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I have a feeling. This this is that point, right? This is the point. I read a review that was like, the game's difficulty scales too fast or something like that. And you know what? Your mileage may vary on that. But what I found is that going around somewhere else sometimes helps. It sometimes helps. This is where I left off yesterday because I couldn't make it past like two rooms above me here. Um, Let's just go try it and see. I'm way, I'm way more powerful now, so it could be, it could be, it could be, you know, just like a god here now, right? You know what I'm saying? Just, just come through and just like, hey, it's, there's a new sheriff in town, right? New and improved sheriff in town. Come here. Can I go through the walls? Oh, sure can. Look at this. Look at this cheese. Look at this cheese. Look at this cheese. Eat that. Eat that. Oh, God. I threw the bomb in the water. <laughs> and then I threw myself in the water. You, no, no, no. You're... Oh, it's money. Let's go get some money so we can lose it when we die. Let's try the poison wave tome. These are all bio characters, especially the, well, I don't know, the jackal thingies, whatever, that follow me around. I feel like those should, they should take extra poison damage. There they go, 104. An extra little tick there. That's a big guy. I think I did, I did more damage to myself with the bomb. There's the purple, it's chasing me. As, as I said before. These guys are annoying. They just basically run and shoot. And they shoot these homing things too, homing discs. What do we got? A ruby ring. Probably no good. We'll check it out anyways. We're in a little bit of bad shape. Not, not, not bad. Not too bad. A little bit of bad shape. Let's see. Melee damage plus 10%. Oh, come on. Magic damage, man. You need the fucking magic damage. Isn't this about right though? <laughs> not getting the, the freaking upgrades you need in RPG. Not getting the roll. Whoa. Oh, oh, that's right, this room. Oh, God. That's right, this room is such a pain. So the trees put down uh, some vines that come out of the road, out of the out of the uh, ground that do, like, one damage each. So they constantly tick because they're hard to see. Um, I mean, they're not hard to see, but they're they're not easy to see when there's a lot of bullets going around. There we go. Oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, man. <laughs> If that death knell got me, I'd be so pissed. <laughs> All right. Now, I made, it, I made it to this room before, but I don't think I made it past it. I just got bombarded with these guys. Too, it's, it's too fast, too much. Just can't let myself get cornered here. Oh, oh big circle. Oh, this guy over here shouldn't be here. I thought he was dead. Let's kill this guy over here. We have some freedom of space over here if we can. Yep, there we go. Yeah, then we could just, just weave, bob and weave. Lots of coin, wow. Lots of coin, lovely. Have I gone past this room? I don't think so, this is my first time. Okay, so I don't know what's ahead. Let's go and heal up. Strap up. Oh, oh hey, I've been here on my easy character. I finally caught up to easy mode. <laughs> what an accomplishment. Let's go up and see if there's a say. Pine Peak, that's right, Pine Peak. And then we come up here, and then we good. And then that's it! 
So yeah, $14.99 Archvale. You can pick it up on Steam. Also available on Switch. This is a perfect Switch game. Um, and then from here, I, well, I, do, I basically I'd go back to the nearest town, drop off my money and all that stuff, right? Bog Town, go drop off my money. Yep, there you go. Cha -cha -cha -ching. And then I hold on to that, do some upgrades, and I continue on my journey. Keep on moving farther and farther into this to try to collect more of these from bosses and shit. There are dungeons, like you see these little things right here, they're like underground dungeons. You know, you just like Legend of Zelda, you roll up, and you get a whole underworld you have to go through. Um, Pretty rad, like this is, this is a pretty good game. Lots of layers, plenty of layers, not a roguelike. So don't get that confused. At first glance, you're like, oh, it's another pixel, pixel based, pixel art, roguelike, adventure game, whatever. No, 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 it's a twin stick. It's a twin stick RPG uh, and it's pretty good. That's it. My name is Mike BAK. Phony Games Call Archvale. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good day and Christmas, I guess, or whatever.